Today was a deadlift session, a speed deadlift session, that also is working on my form. After doing my warm up sets with 135, I just moved to 225 just to a single, get it out of the way. 315, another single. And this is my work weight of today, it's just 405. What I'm doing is I'm staying down at the bottom, making sure I get my hand grip uh, in the best optimal position. Then I'm rolling the bar into myself and just pulling straight up. For me, this is the easiest way to deadlift. Now this may not work for everyone, but for me, this is the form that works for me. What I'm gonna do is five sets of one. And in this video, I'm gonna keep on showing you the form I use. Different people have different forms that work for them. You just have to find the one that works for you. By rolling the bar into myself, and actually staying down like this, I find that I'm, it makes it super easy for me to get the weight off the floor. The only struggle with the deadlift for me is when I get to my knee. That's when I just really have to work on pulling. And the way I'm built, that is mostly my upper back, traps, lats, and a little bit of lower back. Afterwards, I move on the stiff leg deadlifts. Today I went light. But this is actually another exercise that builds my deadlift. In the coming months, I'll keep on adding weight to it. In a previous video, I did 435 for five, and I usually stick with five reps. But today, I just went lighter. Since it's a speed deadlift, I didn't see a need to really go heavy. Just crank it up five reps. Then it moves on to lat pull downs. I usually do three to four sets of eight to 10 reps, increasing the weight each set. In the coming months, I plan on adding at least five pounds a month or 10 pounds a month, if possible, to my lat pull downs. This is another key exercise for me that strengthens my lats and really helps my deadlift. Then follow that with close grip pull downs. The way I deadlift, it's a lot of lats. So the stronger I am at this exercise, the stronger I am at deadlifting. And to give you a coefficient of what I'm talking about is, right now at my heaviest, I can use 285 at home on my lap machine. When I'm at 325 on lap pull downs, that's an over 700 pound deadlift. Then follow it with barbell rows on the incline bench using a cambered bench press bar or called McDonald bench press bar. I did three sets of 10. Thank you for watching. If you have any comments or questions, please leave them below.